Hello everybody and welcome to the Wrestling Nerd Man Cave Tour. This is my dork done, this is where I like to hang out. I'm going to give you a quick tour of everything that I've got going on down here. I'm going to start over here. It's my little desk area. Pretty messy right there right now, but the rest of it's clean. But we got the Road Warriors. A little bit of artwork. Some Hal Haney pieces right there that are pretty cool. Road Warrior Animal. Then we move up here. This is one of my favorite pieces in the whole collection. The Legion of Doom autographed slab piece by Beckett. Then I move over here to the Undertaker urn. Actually got the urn from a buddy of mine who owns a funeral parlor and I was in line for the Undertaker uh, autograph when I finally opened it up. It's I think it's used. So I guess that adds to the story. I don't know. Then we've got the Undertaker slabbed over here. PSA DNA. There we go. Paul Bearer Chase figure. Now let's move into more of the autographs. Over here, got some big names up top here. Seth Rollins, Cody Rhodes, John Cena, Roman Reigns, LA Knight, Vader, Rhea. AJ Styles. Up the hallway, the lights aren't great. We do have a bunch of the 1 of 10 AEW posters. And I come back over here. More autographs, Sting and Flair, combined poster, another Rhea, Cody Rhodes from the Survivor Series that we were at this year, um, Austin and Bret Hart from WrestleMania 13, I was there for that too, so that's a pretty cool one for me. I'll back out a little bit so you can see a little better on some of these. Got the Dig Dug action going. Then we get into more of my Ultimate Collection over here, the figures. It's not complete, but it's getting there. Um, waiting for the new Charlotte to come out so I don't have to pay a ton for that. I know I'm missing at least one Macho Man. Not really sure off the top of my head what else I'm missing at the moment. Come over here, little Four Horsemen wall. Flair, Arn, Tully, JJ, Barry Windham. Barry's kind of down there. Then Lex Luger. That's my favorite Lex, NWA Lex. Got the Simpsons game going here. My son and I play that, the little broski, if you've ever looked at any of our videos. He's funny. And more autographs up here. Then we're going to move over to the Hulk Hogan collection. That's one of my favorite areas of the whole place. Got the Most of the classic line over here. I'm missing some heavy hitters and there's some big ones that I'll probably never get to talk to Brian Myers or Kyle Peterson or Matt Cardona about those. I'm sure one of those guys has those. Yeah, the Hulk Hogan figures, NWO down there, bunch of the bobbleheads, a couple of belts from the WWE shop, ton more figures. Got the new cage over here I thought was pretty cool. I need a shirtless Hogan to go along with the Orndorff out on the side. Hogan Andre in a cage. I went to Russell Fest way back in, I think it was 1988. Uh, Hogan against Andre in a cage in Milwaukee. It was pretty cool. My first ever wrestling show. I go over here, some more Hal Haney art. And then... I got this one personally done, the dual Hulk Hogan, got that with my son. Um, at the same convention, we got that photo done right there, my son and I with uh, Ric Flair and Hulk Hogan, pretty cool. Here's the Roddy Piper, Mean Gene, Vern Gagne up there, WrestleMania 13 poster again, that's done by AJ Moore. LJN collection over here we've got I got the wrong ring apparently but so I have to correct that but the uh, I got these LJN posters they redid them and had them signed it's the super friends you'll find those guys on Facebook and they'll they've got auctions every Wednesday night just look up super friends and they've got a lot of good stuff bought a lot of their stuff and then either it's authenticated already or 
I've gotten a ton of stuff authenticated through JSA after buying it from them, and everything's come back legit every time. So now we're going to move over to the AEW wing. AEW's got what got us back into wrestling. I had become kind of a lapsed fan for a while there, like I think a lot of people did. And then I found AEW and it got me back. Truth is, now I'm probably more of a WWE guy, but either way. Definitely back to being a wrestling household here. So my AEW's kind of crazy here. I've got nearly every figure. Not all of them. I'm missing some of the high-end chases. I think there's a Cody 1 of 500 that's going for outrageous amounts right now. I'll wait on that. Then we move over to the from the chases and rares to the autographs. More autographs here. Up here we've got the 2022 All Out Brawl Out Fan Fest poster. I'm missing some big ones here though. CM Punk, MJF, and the entire Elite. Hopefully I can get that done, but we'll see if CM Punk is even willing to sign this stuff. And I stole this blatantly from a display I saw at, uh, at StarCast before All Out 2023. And I thought it was really cool how they had everything set up. Got the little Spider-Man pointing at each other. I think they did it with Sting. I did it with Mox, obviously. And we're going to move up here. It's my House of Black poster. Got it signed by all four members. Another neat little piece. Some more autographs here. Cody, Dustin, best friends. Adam Cole, baby. And then a few more autographs. Britt, MJF, Brian Danielson, Osprey, and Jay White. And that's about it, guys. Thanks, everybody, for taking a look.